culture is a very interesting concept because I've I've experienced those culture shocks quite a lot. I, I lived in the Middle East. That was very strange. Very strange. I, I go and, 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 and I'm not going to get into why it was so strange, but the fact that it was strange was, was interesting. Because cool. I, I, I get there coming from, you know, being at the time, because I, I don't really class myself as 100% Portuguese anymore, but at the time, 100% pure breed. Like I go in there, this is how I see my world. Everywhere is going to be somewhat the same. Just the landscape looks different. And then it hits you. Oh, hold! I can't say this. I can't do that. Mm. What do you mean? And that was so difficult to, I mean, emotionally, it was so difficult to contend with. I was, I was upset. I was, I could feel myself. And then I could feel myself changing, mm. morphing into that thing. So culture ha has that power over you, but but it, it comes from people. Yeah. And then you, you end up realizing, okay, I got to go. Or if I'm going to stay, I'm going to have to somehow find a way to, to, to cope, but also to make the best out of this. And um, it wasn't a great experience, again, in terms of my personal individual character, it was too much of a shock, but I've also felt those, those shocks when it comes to, to the British culture. And I think you're right. I mean, it's um, the discussion of these ideas is important. I think, I think I'm a big believer in, in having dangerous conversations. And I don't really, I'm not going back to the beginning. I don't really feel anxiety around the, <laughs> like stepping outside the line. It's just not something that I understand even.